What's going on, my friend? Sim Chaff. What the hell is that? What is that? What is that, Private Pile? Oh, sir, it's a Men's Health magazine with, with Justin Bieber, sir. And why is Justin Bieber on Men's Health magazine? Sir, because they think he's aesthetic, sir. Huh. Do you think Justin Bieber has a muscular physique? No, sir, I, I just thought he'd make this a lot of money. Well, he does not. I think he's a disgusting disgrace to masculinity all over the country. Sir, yes, sir. And do you know why Men's Health magazine is the best magazine of fitness in the world? Sir, no, sir, because they don't put Justin Bieber on the front of the magazine. <sighs> Jesus H. Christ. Good God, man. Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber, Bieber, Bieber. Okay, first this guy comes ahead. I don't care if he's going ahead and drag racing down his Miami Beach. I don't care if he's going ahead, he's spitting, hocking up loogies on his fans. I don't care if he's pissing on a button. I don't care if he's going ahead and mouthing off in court. I don't care if he's the greatest thing since sliced bread. You understand that? You understand? I don't really give a damn. I don't give a damn because Justin Bieber doesn't bother me. He doesn't bother me. He doesn't get in my face. He doesn't bother me. You know what I'm saying? He doesn't bother me. He doesn't bother me. He doesn't come near me. He doesn't get near me. But when he comes up in my world, this is my world. This is my house. Right? And shows up. Shows up on the front cover of Men's Health magazine with a shrunken head because they photoshopped the hell out of his body. That's when I got the big problem. I got big, big problems with that because you know something? Alright, let's talk real here for a second. Let's, let's, let's just really talk because we only talk real on this channel. Right? Just some people, right? Right? Dude, he's got, he's got, you know, he's got a body, right? He, he's, he's pretty lean. Hell, I mean, he's probably leaner than me. You know, he probably takes a... Uh, a little bit of clen, a little bit of clenbuterol, if you ever heard of any of it. A um, little bit of clenbuterol to keep him that lean. You know, when he's a teenager, okay, he could be, be that lean. But when he's up in his, uh, what is he, like 21 now? Okay, okay. So some of that, you got to give him props for that, right? He's kind of lean. He's kind of lean. But, I mean, does he even uh, do, do, does he even curl, bro? Does he even curl? Like, does he even bench? Like, where's the chest? Where's the abs? Where's the... Where's the uh, the biceps, man? Like, where's the forearms? Like, what the hell? Like, this is Photoshop, bro. This is Photoshop. This is like straight up Photoshop, and they like that's the best they can do. You see, they didn't show, they didn't Photoshop his head, because if they Photoshopped his head, it would look freaking distorted. So they kind of Photoshopped the rest of his body, and that's why his head is freaking shrunk like that, bro. But I don't got a problem with that. I don't got a problem with that. What I got a problem with is that he's on the front of Health Magazine. That's what I got a problem with. I got a serious, serious goddamn problem with that, because then he's up in my world. You understand? You understand? up in my world okay let's let's be real here so he's got like a lean physique right but he's got zero mass zero mass and there's a big problem with this the big problem with this is that we're gonna this ushers in a new age you think this is over today you think this is over this week why is it i can go to the store and buy this you think this is over this week this ain't over this week this ain't over next month this is gonna take a decade to undo a decade from now on Lean physiques like this will be sought after by women, by men, by all people of all shapes and sizes that want to look like Justin Bieber. And that's a real problem because bad enough we got all these antibodies up, we got all these estrogens up in our water and in the food we eat. Hell, I'm drinking, a, I'm eating some protein right now. Right? There's some protein. Believe me, this, it's got all kinds of bacterias and different things that are bad for you in it. Even stuff like tuna, right? So now we got something to further implement this imbalance of feminism and, and, and demasculizing the man, right? What does this look like to you? Does this look like a man? Seriously? I, to me, to me, it looks like a woman. It looks like a woman to me. I could be wrong. It looks like a woman, okay? We got to get back. We, we're going in the wrong direction. And see, the, the whole world is screwed up. We're going in the wrong freaking direction. You got to understand this. The, 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 the man is supposed to be the masculine one, the jacked one, the swole one, man. The one with the physical power, right? How much do you think Justin Bieber can bench? How, how much do you think he can bench? So, uh, forget about it. How much do you think the dude can squat? You think he could squat? You think he can bench? No, no. He, he, he does, he's not virile. He's not a virile man. He's, he's a moodle. He's a man poodle. That's all he is, right? And do you think... 
Do you think for one instantaneous moment that the political figures run run the show, right? The people in the jackets, the people, the CEOs, Barack Obamas, the politicians. No, 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 no. With 12 billion views on YouTube, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure people like Justin Bieber, people like Katy Perry, people like uh, Angelina Jolie, whatever. I'm pretty sure they run the show. The Justin Biebers of the world really run the show. That's who's, that's who's putting money in your pocket. That's who's running all the chips, all this, and we're all a bunch of rats. We're in a little little rat race, like on a little wheel. That's all we are, right? And it's the Justin Biebers of the world. I'm not talking about the alphas. I'm talking about dicks like this that are the reason why this economy is going down. I promise you, it ain't because of Barack Obama. Barack Obama's a great president. He's doing a fantastic job with what he has right now. It's because of dicks like this and people who allow dicks like this to be on the front news, on the front pages, on the front covers of freaking health magazines. All right, that's what pisses me off. That's what freaking pisses me off. And the way I see it, ladies, you owe me five dozen.